This is an outrage! The Council would step in if the Geth attacked a Turian colony? The Turians don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Traverse. What about Seren? You can't just ignore a rogue specter. I demand action! You don't get to make demands of the Council, Ambassador. Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Seren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. Captain Anderson, I see you brought half your crew with you. I Just the ground team from Eden Prime. In with Eden three Prime. people! I have the mission reports. I assume they're accurate? They are. Sounds like you convinced the Council to give us an audience. They were not happy about it. Seren's their top agent. They don't like him being accused of treason. Saren's a threat to every human colony out there. He needs to be stopped. The Council has to listen to us. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your I'm, candidacy. I'm, I'm sorry. What did the I do? on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus ended up he dead fucked and off. the was destroyed. Nihilus fucked off! Nihilus. Then we better hope the CSEC investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. Come with me, Captain. I want to go over a few things before the hearing. Shepard, you and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. And that's why I hate politicians. Yes, I agree. That's still over ship. There's more of his stuff we can steal. No. Oh. You know, I'm not not normally about a life of crime, but if you're a dick and you leave me alone in your room with the ability to hack your stuff, I, I will. Earth Clan, you are in the wrong place, I think. Your ambassador is next door in the large office. Chastising remark. Don't be so rude, Dan. At least introduce yourself. <sighs> I am Din Korlak, Volus Ambassador. Is there something I can do for you, Earth Clan? Um. I'd like to know more about the Volus. I'm sure our history and culture would bore you, Earth Clan. Actually, I would like to know more about your history. My people came to the Citadel shortly after the Asari and Salarians had discovered it. We were instrumental in establishing a standardized galactic economy. However, despite our long association with the Citadel and our many contributions to galactic society, we still do not hold a seat on the Council. You know what? Goodbye, Ambassador. Uh, yes, yes. Good day, Earth Clan. Oh, I love the Elcor. Elcor are the best. But yeah, no, I, I do also love how hacking doors, hacking computers, it's just, it's just the same thing. It's a. Uh, it's Executive. Paladin and Garrus. Saren's hiding something. Give me more time. Stall them. Stall the council. <coughs> Don't be ridiculous. 
Your investigation is over, Garrus. Commander Shepard, Garrus Vakarian. I was the officer in charge of the CSEC investigation into Saren. You don't look like Saren, I think is an incredibly racist comment. Who were you just talking to? That was executive. I think it just said you don't Get like Saren, but I misread that. He'll be presenting my findings on Saren to the council. Sounds like you really want to bring him down. I don't trust him. Something about him rubs me the wrong way. But he's a spectre. Everything he touches is classified. <laughs> I can't find any hard evidence. Yeah, I reread it. it. So you, you don't around. like Saren. Good luck, Shepard. Maybe they'll listen but, to you. Um. You know, just adding an extra, extra word. Totally different meaning. Don't be ridiculous. The Volus won't be joining the council for years. I'm not so sure. If the humans are making this trouble, why should we keep them in one? So I was having an interesting conversation and I wanted to hear it, but I don't know where it is. The hearing's already started. Come on. I couldn't have got here much quicker. The Geth attack is a matter of some concern, but there is nothing to indicate Saren was involved in any way. The investigation by Citadel Security turned up no evidence to support your charge of treason. An eyewitness saw him kill Nihilus in cold blood. We've read the Eden Prime reports, Ambassador. The testimony of one traumatized dock worker is hardly compelling proof. I resent these accusations. Nihilus was a fellow Spectre and a friend. That just let you catch him off guard. Captain Anderson, you always seem to be involved when humanity makes false charges against me. And this must be your protege, Commander Shepard. One who let the beacon get destroyed. The mission to Eden Prime was top secret. The only way you could know about the beacon was if you were there. With Nihilus gone, his files passed on to me. I read the Eden Prime report. I was unimpressed. But what can you expect from a human? Saren despises humanity. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Your species needs to learn its place, Shepard. You're not ready to join the Council. You're not even ready to join the Spectres. He has no right to say that. That's not his decision. Shepard's admission into the Spectres is not the purpose of this meeting. This meeting has no purpose. The humans are wasting your time, Counselor, and mine. You can't hide behind the Council forever. There is still one outstanding issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the beacon. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? I agree. Our judgment must be based on facts and evidence, not wild imaginings and reckless speculation. Do you have anything else to add, Commander Shepard? No. Just, just no. Because you're going to fucking listen, yo. Yeah, You've made your decision. I won't waste my breath. Like, there isn't anything I can say at this point. The Council point. has found no evidence of any connection between Saren and the Geth. Ambassador, your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. I'm sure you are, you this meeting cocky is bitch. It was a mistake bringing you into that hearing, Captain. You and Saren have too much history. It made the Council question our motives. I know Saren. He's working with the Geth for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. Every colony we have is at risk. Every world we control is in danger. Even Earth isn't safe. Hey, tell me about this history between you and Saren. I worked with him on a mission a long time ago. <laughs> Things went bad. Real bad. We shouldn't talk about this here. But I know what he's like. 
and he has to be stopped. What's our next step? As a Spectre, he's virtually untouchable. We need to find some way to expose him. What about Garrus, that CSEC investigator? We saw him arguing with the Executor. That's right. He was asking for more time to finish his report. Seems like he was close to finding something on Saren. Any idea where we could find him? I have a contact in CSEC who can help us track Garrus down. His name is Harkin. Forget it. They suspended Harkin last month, drinking on the job. I won't waste my time with that loser. You won't have to. I don't want the Council using your past history with Saren as an excuse to ignore anything we turn up. Shepard will handle this. Uh, be easy on the captain. Just cut captain Anderson out of the captain's pretty good. The ambassador's right. I need to step aside. I need to take care of some business. Captain, meet me in my office later. Stop being Harkin's a bitch. Probably drunk at Cora's Den. It's a dingy little club in the lower section of the wards. I thought you said he was a drunken loser. Couldn't hurt to go talk to him. Just be careful. I wouldn't call him reliable. You and Saren have a history. What happened? About 20 years ago, I was part of a mission in the Skillian Verge. I was working with Saren to find and remove a known terrorist threat. Saren eliminated his target, but a lot of people died along the way, innocent people. And the official records just covered it all up. But I saw how he operates. No conscience, no hesitation. He'd kill a thousand innocent civilians to end a war without a second thought. That is... that is a... bit... You know what? You know what? Would you kill a million innocent people to save... or a thousand innocent people to save billions? Not with that, with a second thought, but maybe you know. Um, but he did shoot his friend in the back. Doesn't end wars; it causes them. It also will just cause more. I wars. know how the world works, Commander. Sometimes you're forced to make unpleasant decisions, but only if there's no other way. Saren doesn't even look for another option. He's twisted, broken. He did just shoot his friend he in the back the violence, of the head. The killing, and he knows how to cover his tracks. Um, let's go. I should go. Good luck, Shepard. I'll be over in the ambassador's office if you need anything else. Goodbye, Anderson. I will probably never talk to you again now. Never mind. Um, yes, is there something you want? Why are you so interested in the Keepers? Keepers? I've got no interest in the keep. Don't get coy. I know what I saw. I, uh... I'm not so sure I should be talking to you about this. Relax! Just it's tell fine. me what you're doing. I'm not here to get you into trouble. All right. I guess it wouldn't hurt to tell you. I'm using a small scanner to gather readings on the Keepers. So far I've had mixed results. I find it difficult to get near the creatures. Why were you being so secretive about it, though? Well, technically we're not supposed to disturb the Keepers. I don't really think my scanning disturbs them, but the authorities might disagree. I'd like to do it more openly, but it's not really worth getting arrested over. You know what? I can help you out. I'm Not probably gonna get arrested by a council. I don't even know this. who you are. I'm Commander Shepard with the Alliance Military. Hmm. Well, I, I suppose I could use the help. You'll need this. It's the scanning device I developed. Activated each time you see a keeper. All collected data will automatically upload to my database. I'll even send a few credits your way for each unique scan. What are you doing with the data once you've scanned it? Trying to learn whatever I can about the Keepers. We see them working everywhere, yet we know so little about them. I'm a scientist. I want to know what makes them tick. I, I respect the I scientists want to know what makes them tick, yes, you know? Yes, I have much work myself. So long, and good luck with the scanning.
I saw a keeper over here. Keeper, keeper, keeper. Keeper, keeper, keeper. I don't know why the keepers get their own song, but they do now. Keeper, keeper, keeper. No, I'm waiting to speak with one of the counselor's assistants. Boop. No, I just want to ask a couple of questions. Don't don't mind me sprinting on my gun. It just it just sprints faster. Dozen. Ooh, keeper. Look at that bug thing over there. What's it doing? We Please don't do not know. disturb the keepers. Welcome to the Presidium. Allow me that was the wrong it. button. I meant to get my map out, not my gun. Um where am I going? Refuses to listen to reason. Why can't it act in an orderly and lawful manner? Cora's dead to make drunk say so. Yeah. You should be more tolerant. It's just trying to express its beliefs. I am not unreasonable. The Hanar is free to spew its nonsense once it purchases an evangelical permit. So if the Hanar gets a permit, it's allowed to preach? No. Registered evangelicals must follow regulations. There are specific areas where preaching is legal. Failure to follow the regulations results in the forfeiture of the license. What's the purpose behind the evangelical permits? Forcing religious evangelicals to register for a permit weeds out undesirables. It keeps the area safe. The Citadel is too important to become a battleground for a religious war. If you'd like, I could talk to the Hanar for you. I have argued with the stubborn... Do you desire to learn of the Enkindlers? Or has the Honorable CSEC officer enlisted assistance? Is this really how you want to represent the Enkindlers? The truth of the Enkindlers must be made known. Hanar, they gave the Hanar second best race. And gave the universe the mass relays. This one only wishes to spread the truth to any who will listen. There is no intent to cause trouble. I'll be back. I don't mean this to. This one will continue to spread its message. Any progress with that Hanar? Uh, not yet. Sorry, I'll let you know if I come up with something. 
I don't care what the something is, as long as it rids me of the Hanar. I meant to talk to the Hanar again. Do you desire to learn of the Enkindlers? Or has the Honorable CSEC officer enlisted assistance? Why is the CSEC officer harassing you? The CSEC officer requests that this one purchase an evangelical permit to spread the truth of the Enkindlers. If that's all the CSEC officer wants, why not just buy the permit? The truth of the Enkindlers is universal. This one humbly believes that the truth should not be suppressed. Exacting payment as a means of imposing limits upon the truth is an abrogation of this one's religious freedom. I... Hmm. So you're breaking the law by preaching without a permit right now? The CSEC officer states that preaching in this place is forbidden, and preaching anywhere on the Citadel requires a permit. This one humbly submits that it is not preaching to state the truth of the Enkindlers, and thus, no permit should be necessary. Who are the Enkindlers? Your people know them as the Protheans. They are the true creators of this one's people. The Enkindlers raised the Hanar from ignorance into consciousness by granting this one's people the gift of speech. Let me talk to the CSEC officer. Perhaps I can explain the situation. I'm just gonna go and back and forth be between both? these two Any progress right with now. That Hanar? I think you should let the Hanar preach in the Presidium. The Presidium is a place of culture and respect. It should not be filled with zealots shouting their idiocy. Why should the jellies get special treatment? Every other species understands and obeys the laws. What? Why if I bought the fucking permit? If I purchased the evangelical permit myself, would that take care of things? As long as it stays in approved areas once it has the permit, yes. That would solve the issue for me. Why do I... Why do I buy said permit? I'll be back. I don't care what you have to do. Just get rid of that hand art. Why do I buy... Has the CSEC officer been assuaged? Uh, not yet, no. I'll keep working on it. This one will continue. Any progress with that Hanar? Right. I just... I think you should let the Hanar preach in the Presidium. The Presidium is a place of culture and respect. It should not be filled with zealots shouting their idiocy. Why should the jellies get special treatment? Every other species understands you know, and obeys the laws. You won't tell me where to buy this... I'll be back. ...goddamn permit. I don't care what you have to do. Just get rid of that Hanar. I will, once I figure out how to buy a permit. It, it wouldn't let me buy it. I have to buy the permit, and he's there like, get rid of the Hanar. Any progress with that Hanar? I think you should let the Hanar preach in the Presidium. The Presidium is a place of culture and respect. It should not be filled with zealots shouting their idiocy. Why should the jellies get special treatment? Every other species understands and obeys the laws. If I purchased the evangelical permit myself, would that take care of things? As long as it stays in approved areas once it has the permit, yes. That would solve the issue for me. If I purchased the evangelical permit myself, would that take care of things? As long as it stays okay. in approved areas once it has the permit, yes. That would solve the issue for me. Great. I'll be back. <laughs> I don't care what you yeah. do. Yeah. I was, I was pretty off. sure he wouldn't let me fucking buy it off of him. I'll just... I'll just... Oops. I keep accidentally pulling my gun out. Right, let's just let's just sprint over to C sec. I'm gonna sprint over with my gun out. It's quicker.
So, Williams, are you happy you signed on with Commander Shepard? I'm not sure, Lieutenant. Every time I think I have a handle on things, the universe banks hard to port. Well, don't let anybody know. A big gun and a confident attitude will get you through a lot in life. That's what she said? A gun is not the answer. Um... Sec, looking you up. Commander Shepard here with the Alliance military. First time on the Citadel, that about right? Yep. How did you know all that? I'm the CSEC requisitions officer. I need to make sure our buyers are authorized. So, will you be purchasing anything today? Commander okay, Shepard? this is where I buy supplies. I'd I do not want supplies. Serving, Commander. You have a good day now. I want a permit. <laughs> yeah, I don't think ever anyone will be happy if I end up killing a CSEC officer on the way to the bar because he wouldn't sell me a goddamn permit. I don't think a gun's the answer to this. Um, I don't think this room's the answer to this. You know, we'll, we'll talk with the requisitions officer again. We'll see if we'll sell if we'll see if he sells permits. Hello, Commander. Show me what you got. Excellent. I hope you find what you're looking for. Oh. Uh... No. No, I can't buy the permit here. Uh, so currently my options are shoot a man. Or look elsewhere to buy a permit. How you holding up, Lieutenant? Not too bad. No headaches worth mentioning lately. Maybe I'm getting used to the strain. Maybe you've just got a good stress release. I know that knocking the geth on their synthetic asses gets rid of my headaches. Yeah, but your head headaches aren't caused by like a faulty implant that affects your not false powers. You know, go, go over to the Emporium. The Emporium sounds like it'll be a place to buy a permit. Welcome to the Presidium. Allow me to you know, I do love that, like, he's having an issue with the Hanar preaching because, you know, gotta, gotta look couth and everything. I'm just sprinting with an assault rifle. I've had my office rearranged five times. Five times? Why? What do they want? Level up.
Keep it, keep it, keep it. I keep accidentally pulling my gun out when I want to check the map. Which... Ah, you, you know, it's not ideal. This one is greatly pleased to see you here in my decadent emporium. Who are you? This one's face name is Delaninder, though many in this place simply refer to it as Delan. Please take time to examine the fine goods it has for purchase, all of great worth. Show me your items. Oh, this one is pleased to do so, human. You will not be disappointed. Okay. Okay, there's normally upgrades I can buy after I run all the way back to the Hanar again. Because apparently I might just be able to fight, talk to him, be like, I'll I'll pay for it, just just go. Stop pissing off this CSEC officer. Any progress with that Hannah? Uh I'm still trying. Sorry. I'll let you know if I thought if I was looking directly at him is, as long as and he was the between the two of us, I would talk to the Hannah. Has the CSEC officer been assuaged? Is this really how you want to represent the Enkindlers? The truth of the Enkindlers must be made known. They gave the Hanar language, and gave the universe the mass relays. This one only wishes to spread the truth to any who will listen. There is no intent to cause trouble. What if I purchase the evangelical permit for you? Finances are only a partial limitation. This one does not believe that one should pay in order to speak the truth. However, this one also does not possess the 150 credits necessary to purchase the permit. 150 credits. This should cover you. This is a most appreciated action. You are not of the Hanar, but you wish to help spread the truth of the Enkindlers. This one will not cause any further trouble for the CSEC officer. This one offers its thanks. Well, there you go. I see the Hanar is left. Thank you. Happy to help. Here, for your assistance in this matter. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should report to my superiors. There we go. Finally help the Hannah. I keep accidentally pulling my gun out. This is a this is a real problem. I just wait just wait to check the map. Want to check map, accidentally pulls out assault rifle. That's not my map. <laughs> 